Tour who is going to explain to us the proper etiquette for using a roundabout. It seems like it's something that a lot of people are kind of intimidated by and Raph here is an engineer and he's also originally from Argentina which he tells me they have like four lane roundabouts that are a little bit more intimidating than what we need to deal with. So Raph. All right well uh, like I was telling Rhonda the first thing you need to know or to think about is not to panic uh, when you face roundabouts for the first time. Uh, for those of you who may have faced them before the first rule of a roundabout So if there is a car in it, make sure that you have let it let it clear before you enter the roundabout. Then what you want to think about is what you want to do in the roundabout. In this case, uh, the roundabout has two lanes and then there is a third lane to the right where you can make an exit onto the highway. But in most roundabouts you will have one or two lanes and from the outside lane you can turn to the right or continue straight. And in the inside lane you can continue straight or make a left hand find yourself in the wrong lane for what you want to do or if you find yourself with a car on the outside lane when you're on the inside and you're trying to exit just stay on the roundabout and let the other car exit wherever they're going to exit from the outside lane and then you can switch to the outside lane and then you'll have free access to whatever exit you want to do uh, there is no shame in doing one more turn in the roundabout that you need to and if you find yourself on the outside lane and there's a car that apparently is going to go into the exit, uh, it's better to either slow down or just go with them and come back into the roundabout. So once again, don't panic. Know what you want to do. Yield to traffic that is in the roundabout. And then make sure that you exit where you want to exit from the outside lane. And you can switch lanes or stay in the roundabout if the need arises and I think that covers it okay well thank you so much and my friend Raph here is also a very avid biker so if you see him out there what you need the etiquette for that is to roll down your window wave honk a whole lot and say hey Raph because that's what I do when I see him okay <laughs>